me to cook and eat later. Like, mm, what's that fishy taste like? That's nasty. <laughs> I'm back with another video, whatever, whatever, whatever. Today I'll be reading and ranking y'all nasty confessions. I have a ranking list, and on the ranking list, the bottom one is gel you go. Then the other one is get a therapist. Then the next one, let's talk about it. You know, it might not be bad. No, it's bad because we need to talk about it. And understandable. Mm, come say these say it's, it's not bad, okay? And then literally same i probably did the same thing but going on here um i don't know if i'm gonna have any of them that i personally have did um one time my boyfriend came over and i sucked his um peter whacker at 10 minutes um from i think they meant <laughs> my mom walked in on us Wait, what? My boyfriend came over and I sucked his Peter Wacker. After 10 minutes my of sucking, my mom walked in on us. Then she joined and sucked his Peter Wacker too. Um, firstly, I think English isn't our first language. I'm playing. <laughs> But secondly, second of all, I think this is fake. Cause there's no way on God's living earth that your mom joined in. What type of P hub stuff is this? And if this is real, I want you to block me on every social media because there's no way. Please. <laughs> that was a good joke. But um <clears throat> for the ranking, I'm gonna put this at um go to jail because literally um i mean your mom should go to jail but why would you let your mom do that you know what i mean like you let your mom suck your boyfriend's peter racker like willingly and you did it for 10 minutes um all right, bestie. We're just gonna. <laughs> mm, I don't know what to say about that one anymore. Um, <clears throat> next one. There's this one girl in my class. She's fine AF, and there's one problem. She has a boyfriend. Okay. <laughs> what her boyfriend gonna do? You know what I mean? I feel like a lot of people. A lot of people already do that. So I mean, just. You... Is their relationship that serious? Like, are they like a for real thing? Or is it like a joke? Like, I mean, you should just go for it. <laughs> just go for it a little bit. I'm gonna just put this one in understandable because you know, it happens, it happens. You know what I mean? It happens to everybody. Um, the next confession, I eat in the bathroom, not while bathroom i just do it because bathroom is my safe place hmm okay well um i think this person was the same person who wrote the first one because <laughs> mm, i don't know if english is y'all is y'all second language but like i'm sure having a hard time reading this and like i'm low-key low-key y'all dyslexic and like this is not gonna work for me <laughs> Y'all, Aries is not gonna work for me. Like, how am I supposed to, you know what I mean? Please, don't let it happen again, though. But, <clears throat> um, my opinion, I don't think it's that weird. If you're talking about, like, a bathroom bathroom and not, like, a school restroom, I mean, I guess, but, like, if you, like, in the restroom at school, and like people just shitting in there and that's just you just feel safe in there i don't think i think that's weird but um i'm gonna put this one in let's get a therapist or get a therapist 
because um we need to talk about why do you feel safe in there you know what i mean like you okay you need to talk i could be your therapist for real for real if you need it if you need it i could be your therapist you know what i mean but um <clears throat> next one i like these two juniors one in track the other in my sixth period i'm a guy <laughs> Okay, like, I feel like there's nothing wrong with that. Go for both of them, you know what I mean? <laughs> Go for both of them. Like, why not, you know what I mean? Why well, keep saying that? Like, yeah, just go for it. <laughs> go for it. Like, go for both of them. Like, they not even the same, you know. You know what I mean? You have one in track and then one in six period. That's a... I would go for them if I was you. Go for it, and yeah. I'm gonna put this one in understandable because it really is. Like, I like I like these type of confessions. They're normal, and yeah. That one was real cute, real nice. I used a cucumber to pleasure myself and put it back in the refrigerator. Okay, um, my thing is, why did you put it back in the refrigerator? For your family to cook and eat later? You're like, hmm, what's that fishy taste? Like, that's nasty. I know this is nasty what I'm gonna say, but like, did you at least wipe it off or rinse it or something? Did you clean it after? Why couldn't you just throw it away? Why did you use food? I have so many questions and there's so many unanswered. <laughs> this is never going to get answered. <laughs> They're not going to get answered. Oh my gosh. Please. Um, I'm going to rank this as in you need to go to jail because that is literally disgusting. And... I hope that your family didn't eat that because, um, wow. I hope, I, I hope, they can't even get my words out. They're so nasty. Okay, next one. I almost did the nasty on the way to school. By the way, I ride the bus. Um, I mean, you didn't do it. So, I mean, like, okay. Like, what did you do? Like, did you just, I don't know. I mean, if you didn't do it, I mean, it's not bad, but like on the bus, like, I'm gonna just, um, hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna put this in literally same. I'm not gonna say too much. I'm gonna just put it in there and we're just gonna go to the next one, okay? Um, oh, this one's not even a fashion, but I'm gonna say this. I'm so so proud of you, Gwenny Pooh London. Oh, I love you, London. <laughs> I love you. I'm not gonna rate that one because I don't, I don't know how to put that one <clears throat> in, but I love you too, London. And I'm, I'm gonna make sure you get this part in. Hopefully, you watch this because if you don't, <laughs> I don't know, but you better watch this. I lost my V-card to someone I knew for only a week. Okay, well, um, I don't condone to that because you don't know. In that week, did y'all talk about STDs and all that other germ stuff? And why? Why would you do that? But I'm not going to say too much because also... It's your business. I don't know, babes. This one, I'm gonna put this one in. <laughs> We're gonna put this one in. Let's talk about it because, um, a week. <laughs> mm -mm. Next one. I f my boyfriend on my sister's floor. 
Okay, well, um, where's your room at? Literally, like, where's your room? And, like, you did it on the floor. Like, you, be for real, please. Because out of all places, you did it on the floor and in your sister room. The flow in your sister room. The floor, okay. Where is your room at? Why couldn't you do it in your room? Like, literally. Where is your room? And where was your sister? And is she okay? Because I know that's probably very traumatic. If she doesn't already know. It's traumatic. And literally... I don't know what to rank you. Maybe, um, let's, let's, uh, let's talk about it. Because I don't know what the therapist could do for you. And <laughs> a out a girl in pre-K. How do you know what that is in pre-K? I barely knew my numbers. I barely knew my letters in pre-K. And you talking about eating the girl out? What is going on in y'all life? Y'all are nasty. And pre-K? Pre-K, like for real. Pre-K. What was you doing at recess? Literally, I was, I was on a jungle gym. I was on a swing. I was with friends. I was scared of guys, you know, coolies and all that. And you over there eating cool. Cool. That's nasty. You're nasty. And, 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 and I don't even know what to say. I don't even know what to say. Except, jail you go. Because, <laughs> ew. Pre-K? Be so for real. I ate toes. I mean, I don't feel like that's weird, in my opinion. I don't think that's weird. Did you like it? I mean, I don't think that's weird, to be honest. I feel like a lot of people do that. Like, that's kind of normal. I'm going to put that in understandable. Because, I, but I feel like you got to really love somebody to do that, bitch. <laughs> like, I wouldn't do it, but like. That's, that's good for you that you have. <clears throat> I might do another one because it was really fun. I really like reading y'all crazy things because it makes me feel better about myself. So thank y'all for whoever sent. <laughs> thank, thank you to everybody who sent their confessions because you're really bold. You have the courage for me to embarrass you and put it on YouTube and do all this. So um, thank you for that. And yeah, I'm gonna just end the video here because I need a break. I need a break from um I need a break from y'all drama. But anyway, thank y'all for watching this video and also thank y'all for 200 subscribers. Like that's so good. <laughs> but thank you for watching. If you like this video, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all later.